again everybody um today i have another opening to do i just got this in the mail today ow this oof that's close today i got this pokemon trading card game sun moon team up elite trainer box um this will be like the second elite trainer box i've opened the first one being the shining legends right there um and i kind of i made a May have become a little spoiled with that one because that one you're guaranteed at least a hollow in every pack and it came with a promo card and this one isn't that. This is more like a traditional where it comes with eight packs. But one thing I like about getting these is for one I like the marker and the stuff. I like the book it comes with and um, the sleeves. I really like getting the sleeves and I want to start using them for um, my decks. So there's everything that comes on the back. There's just the bottom. Um, yeah, I just got this in the mail today. I'm really excited for it. I have been kind of focusing more on collecting up some stuff from Shining Legends, just because I think they look really cool. But, and uh, Celestial Storm, just because the first few booster packs I bought were Celestial Storm. So I've kind of started working on those, but recently started, I randomly bought a blister pack like this one from Target, and out of it, I pulled this gorgeous Pikachu and Zekrom GX tag team card, just out of a random impulse buy in the checkout line at Target. So it kind of got me wanting to get a trainer box, even though I've seen a lot of things where the pulls don't seem to be the best out of these all the time. But um, I figured, well, I'd give it a shot, and then it gets me kind of a, I don't know, somewhere to start with uh, more of a tag team, or a, yeah, like a team up set. And I do I do have these two, the Blastoise and the Charizard deck back there. Um, but before we get into the trainer box, I thought I'd crack open this bad boy. Just another blister pack I got from the Checkout Line at Target again. Just kind of a little gamble to see what we can get. I kind of wish it was a different coin. I think I got Litten out of the last one, but that's fine. So. There's the back of that. Let me just crack this open. Carefully. And I got the Venusaur and Celebi art. And then a nice little system where you... Oop. Well, hopefully by the time the video goes up I use that code. I'm, I apologize for not giving any out or anything. I try to play the game online and so I like to keep the the codes when I can. So this time I got um, the one with Pikachu and Raichu as the promo cards because the last time I got Magikarp and Gyarados. So I wanted to switch up the promos that came with uh, the pack that I got. So here's the cute little Litten coin that comes with it. And here are the promos. And I think these are from Burning Shadows, which is another set I've never uh, bought anything from, I've never collected from or used. Maybe someday, but we'll see. So, pretty cool. This one's a hollow. And, yeah. So I'll set those off to the side. Oh, i love to get more cards like this. <laughs> I'm really hoping that there's some, at least one of something like this in this box. All right. Move this out of the way. So this is just a little bonus. I originally meant to just open this the trainer box today, but then I saw this at Target. I was like, sure, why not? And I give it a shot, a shot again. So there's the back. And let's get into that. Let's see what we got out of this one this time. I like to at least keep some of the packs I open just in case I want to. I'm interested in like the artwork on them and and everything. If I could ever get this open. All right. I apologize. Thanks for bearing with me. Oh my gosh. There. Now it should come out. Jeez. Oh boy. All right. Just a green code card. Womp womp. So, the last video I did, 
with the X and Y cards, which I've never done before. So I gotta remember to get back into doing four cards to the front with an energy being at the front. I really do like these team up energy cards. I think they look very nice. All right, so out of this one, basically open for like a reverse hollow, uh, rare. So you got fire energy, Tauros, Persian. And this is my first time seeing a lot of these because I got what's in the decks, these decks back here, but there's not very many options of things. Um, I kind of see the same cards over and over and over again. So Dratini, Zorua, Psyduck, Emolga, Staryu, Reverse Hollow, Galvantula, which is a rare, and Amanda Buzz. Now, I do also admit that I don't know very many of the newer Pokemon, because again, I'm just getting back into it. And I really just know the first like three generations very well, and through other means, I've kind of gotten a realization of, a recognition, <laughs> words, of uh, some of the newer Pokemon. But yeah, I'm still kind of getting an idea. I haven't played all the games. I never played Sun and Moon, sadly. I wanted to, just never got around to it. So yeah, so that was that pack. And uh, now I'm just going to take the plastic off of this. I know, I apologize for this odd angle for the time being while I'm opening this up. And someday, if I keep doing... I said this in my last video, but if I keep doing these like openings like this, I might try to figure out a better system for recording... Right now, this is what I've got in the small space I have. So, this looks pretty nice at the end. So let me slide this out. And here's the box. Put that to the side for the time being. And then here is the sleeve it came in. And pulling out of it comes this... You get the player's guide, which can be kind of fun to look at. I love this artwork. It looks so nice. Another reason why I'm so happy to get this card. I like that blue outline. It, it's kind of the inverse of this picture a little bit. So, um, but in here you get all the, all this stuff. You get some art and card list information about various things. Um, so. Yeah, some pulling one of these would really be would be very nice out of this box. So, wow, this art just looks so cool. Right, so yeah, you get that, and then inside the sleeve that the box was in, you may have seen this before if you've watched other videos, but I'm not gonna tear mine apart right now. I might someday, but inside there's all the the pack art for all the various uh, packs you can get, and the team up cards so that's just on the inside of the sleeve that was around the whole thing that's kind of a neat thing that they do and they've done seems like for a while with their elite trainer packs and then here's the meat of what we're here to get i'm gonna slide that off here we got a a divider pull that out which this divider is set up much more efficient and nicer than the uh, shining legends box i opened up so in the middle here we got damage counter dice with like a two-tone look to them, hence the like tag team stuff. And um, yeah, so that stuff. And then more acrylic tag, or some GX markers, which this one feel, looks bigger than the last one that I had. Maybe, it's probably not, but it seems like it. And it's the new tag team style. So that's really cool. Here are all the, the packs. There should be eight of them. The sleeves look very nice. I really like getting these out of these boxes. Um, code card for the box. The dividers, if you want to keep your cards in the box, also look very nice. I really like the Pikachu Zekrom artwork. And then. A bunch of energies, which helps when just trying to build a deck. So someone like me, who's just getting started, these can be really helpful. So, move those aside. 
Let me slide this back on. Not that you can see it. But. All right. So now, let's see here. We've got it has to be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight of these. So let's do. We'll kind of do one of each as we go through. Oh no! Wait, I have. Oh, well, anyway, we'll do them in this order. So first up, we have an EV end Snorlax pack. Uh, I'm still not good at opening these, opening these efficiently while also not trying trying to not destroy the pack. Sun and Moon, so Metal Energy, a War Turtle, Heliolisk, Buff Padding, Squirtle, Bronzor, Klefki, Pidgey, Molga, Reverse Hollow Star You, and the rare is a B Drill. <laughs> it's funny, I just uh my last video was X and Y Evolutions pack packs, a bunch of them, and I pulled a couple rare B drills out of it, saying how it seems like they get pulled a lot in here. The very first one of this newer video is a B drill as the rare, so that's just kind of funny how that worked out. All right, so that was one down. Now we got the Mimikyu and Gengar. Another green code card, so hopefully a rare hollow, or rare reverse, I mean. Did I just do three? <laughs> Oops. <laughs> well, that happens. Okay, Dark Energy, Torquette, Kabuto. I saw an edge, so I'm hoping I got a Prism Star out of this. I've never gotten one of those, so that'd be really cool. Uh, Nidorino, Helioptile again. Or no, never mind. Execute. Ferroseed, Meowth, Alolan Geodude. There it is. <laughs> I haven't gotten a Prism Star card yet, so Wondrous Labyrinth, nor do I have a Stadium card. Non fairy Pokemon, both yours and your opponents cost more. Interesting. I'll have to look more into what this card can do and what it can be used for. I've never seen or used a Prism Star before, but I'm very happy with getting one. And then a Pangro, Pangoro. Very cool. So I didn't get it was a white it wasn't a white code card, nothing real crazy GXing or out of it, but I think that's still a pretty cool. Pretty cool pull out of that. Alright. My boy Pikachu and Zekrom. Let's see what we get out of this one. Really love to get like a full art full art card. Of any kind. I've just been really enjoying another green one. Really enjoying going through packs again. <laughs> I know I say that like every video, but it just really takes me back. Okay, Fire Energy, Ammonite, Taurus, Lavender Town, Dratini, Alolan Grimer, Ponyta, Cosmog, Voltorb. Ooh, there's a reverse rare. Zoroark. I have the Zoroark GX I got out of the uh, Shining Legends pack, which is very cool. And I have a lot of Zoro cards, so who knows, maybe this could come in handy someday. And then an Aerodactyl non-holographic rare. Also a very cool looking card. I remember as a kid, I really liked... Um, I was really a big fan of the Aerodactyl card. And then, like the base set, or the fossil, or whatever. I forget exactly. I apologize. All right, so it's three down. We got Venusaur and Celebi next. Huh. 
Oh, a white code card. Very exciting. Oh, four. All right. Ooh, fairy energy. Look at that pink. Hello, and Graveler. Nita. I don't think I have that one yet. Taurus. Zoroa. Speaking of Zoroark back there, here's Zoroa. Larvitar. I really like the back of this card. It's really clever. Psyduck. Volibee. Weedle. Huh, another Zoroa. Reverse Hollow. And for the rare, Celebi and Venusaur GX. Another tag team card. This is just the, the regular, not a full or anything, but I'll definitely take it to add to my tag team card collections. Oh, very cool. Very, very cool. These cards just look, they look so nice. And adding this tag team in with like the three prize card thing is another nice, another f potentially fun twist of the game. I haven't played the trading card game all that much, but I think it's really cool to just add things like this here and there. Oh, that is nice. That's kind of what I wanted. It makes me very happy with that box so far. We have a few packs to go still, so here's uh, hoping for more. Yeah, we're halfway through. So we got Eevee and Snorlax again. I really like the textures on the full art cards. And I think, or like the shining cards from the Shining Legends. I think those all look really cool. All right, another green code card. Lightning Energy, Brock's Grit. My last video with the X and Y fold a full art Brock's Grit. Pokemon Communication, which apparently if you get the, there's like the secret rare or whatever, it's really a really rare card of this. Sorry for that out of focus. Flaffy, Paris, Pawniard, Staryu, Honage, Weedle, Reverse Skarmory. That looks really cool. It's also a rare, so it's another reverse rare. That's really neat. I guess I'll take that too, you know, if I'm not gonna get another fancy one. But that, that metal look on the reverse hollow looks really cool. And the rare in this pack will be another Galvantula. This one, not a reverse hollow, though, like my last one. All right. Three more packs to go. Another Eevee and Snorlax. Ooh, white code card. It's always exciting when you get that. <laughs> get four. All right, let's see what we got out of this one. Probably just a, revert, or a rare hollow or something, but that's cool. I like getting just something out of them. All right, water energy. Morgan, another one I don't think I have yet. Cool. Flaffy. Jinx. Pidgeotto. Charmander. Star you, Litten, another Zoroa. Man, I got a lot of Zoroas. Reverse Hollow Weedle. It's kind of a cute little card, a little cute little art on that. And the rare in this one is a full art Morgan Trainer card. Very nice. I've definitely been happy with this box so far, with the packs I've gotten in it. I was worried because I've seen some. I know you can't necessarily control that. But I've seen some uh, Elite Trainer box openings where the pulls weren't that great out of it, but it's because it's just kind of random, you know. So, man, very, 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 very cool so far. Very happy with these. Two more to go. I'm really hoping, I mean, of course, I'm all hope. you always want more. <laughs> but some, pla some last pack magic would be really cool, especially out of the Zekrom Pikachu. The thing that started up this tag, this team up desire for me to open up with that full art card. Be cool to get some luck with them again. All 
All right, another green card. Psychic Energy, Electro Charger, Charmeleon, Water Memory, Vulpix, Joltik, Blitzel, Sleepy Squirtle, Tentacle, Reverse Hollow is a Jinx, which is not uncommon, and the rare is a Zebstrika, non holographic card. Alright, now we've got some. I'm happy with what I've gotten so far. Let's see if we can get one more nice thing out of this last pack with Pikachu and Zekrom on it. Ah, oh, man. I know you're all probably there watching me. Like, just open it already. <laughs> Green code card. Okay. Well, let's see what we still get out of this. Looks like no real crazy last pack magic. But you never know. Maybe another prism star, but probably not. Oh, upside down apparently. Yep. Alright, lightning energy. Kangaskhan. Nidorina. Which I really like the um Nidoqueen in this like in the in the decks I got. The Nita Queen is a really powerful um, ability. Sabrina's Suggestion, Weedle, Joltik, Blitzel, Paris, Vullaby. Ooh, another reverse rare. Mimikyu this time. That's really cool. I've gotten a lot of reverse rares out of this pack. And the rare is a Parasect. So, I guess I haven't been paying attention to haven't been setting aside all my reverse rares, but that's okay. Because I have for those, I have the Mimikyu here. And Zoroark. I think Zoroark, it's a cool name too. I like that. I got a my first ever Prism Star, Wondrous Labyrinth. And then... A Celebi and Venusaur GX Tag Team card. And a Morgan Support Trainer card, Full Art. Which, I can't tell, it kind of looks like, seems like a chip. I can't tell if it's supposed to be like that or not, but right there, there's kind of this, this odd spot in the card. Either way, really cool. Thanks again for watching. I'm looking, I hope to do more of these videos. If you have any suggestions for me, <laughs> anything like really anything like how i hold the cards how i open the packs what i do um just feel free to leave any suggestions because i'm new to this and i'm willing to take uh, anything you have to say to mind so i appreciate you watching especially since this video is longer than it needed to be <laughs> and i really hope that you have a great rest of your day thanks again